The actor Anton Yelchin is with me, and you are shooting yet again something. Um, we're thinking that Anton deserves it. We're trying to continue his legacy, and we want uh, audience and people to know more about him, not only as an actor, but as a musician, as a photographer, and a thinker, and a friend, and a beautiful son. An amazing human being. My parents came to this country not knowing a word of English and just started to work. My mom, I owe her everything for believing in me. He had a curiosity that with most people degrades over time. I mean, he impacted so many people. I think people keep asking where the challenge is. And then, truthfully, we interviewed 60 plus people. It was trying to fit everybody as we, everyone in the film. But, you know, you have to, you know, some people have to make some sacrifices and not be, but no feelings were ever hurt, you know. He's kind of in and out of shooting and he didn't really go home all that much. So he had all this time on his hands and Anton, with a lot of time on his hands, you know, he was gonna do something interesting. Once he wanted me to go to um, a Tarkovsky f film exhibition that sounded like the worst way to spend my time in the world. It's not all interview in the movie. We had to, Garrett had to cut a lot of like very big names. Now every, everything I make, I try to find people like Anton to work with because he was an actor, but he wasn't an actor. All that crap that comes with being an actor, he never had. He got rid of all that from the beginning and that was so inspiring to be around because it was always about the work. He was in the business for the exact right reasons and nothing else. So I think that's it. And also his presence. I mean, he was so present as an actor. He's an incredible listener, incredible improviser, and present in a way, not in the future, not in the past, that very few actors are.